Hi, I'm Stephen Keston from GrappleArts.com, friend and training partner Chad Scans. Thanks for coming down. Today, a Kimura finish that's one of my favorites that I don't see a lot of people doing. So, if you get a Kimura grip on the arm, you've got to do a couple of things. You've got to move the elbow up, you've got to lift the elbow up, and then shove the hand this way, right? That's simplifying things. And typically, you're going to either apply it here, or you're going to step over the head, or you're going to be applying it from sort of a north-south position here. But there's a lot of movement in those positions. So one way I find myself applying the Kimura a lot is to get the grip, put the hand on the floor, put the elbow on the floor here, but then to finish it, I move around the head and I sprawl on the shoulder and I just pull a little bit. I call this the lazy old fat man's Kimura because it doesn't involve a whole lot of movement. Basically, I'm pinning Chad's shoulder to the ground using my ribs, using the side of my ribs while holding this in place. So, see here? In this grip, Chad's shoulder is off the ground. There's about a fist's worth of distance between his shoulder and the ground just because it's going over the lever or the fulcrum of this forearm. So to apply the Kimura, essentially I'm dropping all my weight down on the shoulder while holding the hand on the ground. See, this hand's on the ground. When I push the shoulder down, the hand pops up. But what happens when the hand's pinned to the ground and I drop my weight here? You get a Kimura. Let's just rotate a bit here for the chat. This yep. So once again, maybe I've got this Kimura grip here. On this side, I could go for the arm bar. I could go for a north-south Kimura. In this case, I decide to pull it to the floor and now I'm going to take the side of my ribs and drop it on the shoulder here. I'm a fat, lazy old guy. I don't want to move a lot. And I just put a bunch of weight on the shoulder. If that's not enough, I do a little bit of a pull here. This is one of those techniques that you don't think is going to work when you see it at first. Because there's no control over the body. There's no weight on his chest. There's no weight on his hips. There's no weight on his head. All the weight is here. But that's okay. You're putting all of your weight on one arm and putting into a compromised position, he's not actually going to move anywhere. So this is one of the things that I saw and it's like, this is never going to work. And now it's one of my main Kimura attacks. I hope you give the lazy fat old man's Kimura a go as well.